what's going on folks i am here with paul from pull right now they are what they like to say the last of the mohicans they produce their own product they don't branch out into a hundred other products this is kind of their thing right yeah we are a fifth wheel hitch manufacturer we have a fifth wheel hitch for every truck we have the best fifth wheel hitch for every truck okay kind of explain what we're looking at here Well, first off, I want to tell you all Pull Right products are 100% U.S. made with 100% U.S. raw materials. We get nothing from offshore. We're family owned, and this is what we do, and we do it right. Okay. So, this hitch here is our Pull Right 2600. This is designed to be a lightweight offset hitch. Uh, it's going to work in a short bed truck with some turning uh, limitation. We've got a competitor that builds a similar version of this out of aluminum. We use all high grade U.S. steel. And the reason why we use steel is because it's going to hold up really good. Mm -hmm. The hitch works really easy. We simply attach this piece to the fifth wheel kink pin. This stays on there. Once you put it on, you're good to go. To hook up, all you have to do is get anywhere close on the funnel, lower the trailer jack, and the trailer funnels right into the hitch. To latch it, it's just a very simple twist, and we're locked. The best thing about this style of latch is you can hook up at any angle or on completely uneven surfaces. So if we're at an angle and we're uneven, we can undo this latch that easily and the trailer will actually unhook. So it's a really easy hitch to use. It's lightweight at about 60 pounds. We have a bed saver. This actually gives us an insulating barrier between your truck bed and your hitch. These don't bolt, they're completely uh, removable, so it's gonna protect your truck bed. Okay. The other big thing that we do at Pull Right is not only do we design and build a great hitch, but we do what we call SAE J2638 testing on all our products. This is over 900,000 cycle counts of pushing, pulling, tugging in every direction. At Pull Right, not only do we build a great hitch, but we tow with our hitches. All of our staff uh, have trucks or access to trucks, and we tow with our products, and we use them. Okay, and I see that this is essentially a reverse of your competitor that you talk about, right? So whereas the competitor has the ball that kind of sits on top of the pedestal, yours Yeah, their hitch sits down. like this, and I like to say we, we use a steel funnel, not a plastic. And I like to say that ours is anatomically correct, because if you were going to pour liquid in a funnel, you would do it this way, mm -hmm. uh, not backwards with the funnel here. Okay. So. And how does this mount to the bed of the truck? It looks like it mounts to your goose ball. Yep. We just mount to any gooseneck ball. We have a box here. This is called the hitch box. This pins to the ball. You can see this bolt right here is this bolt. So it, the whole hitch sits on top of this, and we got two bolts that draw it down or attach it. To okay. the gooseneck ball. It so takes currently, about five minutes. So I see this is rated at twenty thousand pounds. Do you have any that are rated heavier in case somebody has maybe a heavier toy hauler or a heavier RV? Right now the twenty K is the biggest that we do, which is gonna cover probably mm. more than ninety eight yeah. or it's gonna cover a huge percentage of all the fifth wheels on the market. Absolutely. So what kind of warranty comes with this product? Five years on everything. Okay. We're, we're a pretty no-hassle company when it comes to warranty. We can be that way because we don't have many claims. Well, it's a really cool product. And like I said, with me and my subscribers know, I use the Goose Box only because I like my open bed. But if that wasn't a factor for me, this would be a really good hitch to, to look at. And, and the Goose Box, nothing, uh, don't have anything bad to say about that product. Some of the benefits by towing with this versus a Goose Box, you might get a little bit tighter connection up here. Because when the ball goes into the socket, we've only got two thousandths inch tolerance, so we don't get any bumping or mm -hmm. chucking. So we get a little bit tighter. The other nice thing is uh, when you put the goose box on, you now can only tow the trailer with a gooseneck hitch. Mm -hmm. With this, you can still tow with a regular fifth wheel hitch. You can tow with this style hitch. So it, it gives you a little yeah. bit more versatility than just going that. And we're going to probably save you a couple dollars over towing. Uh, with the goose box. Well, another nice thing as well is if you go to upgrade your fifth wheel with the goose box and you want to keep it, you have to unbolt the whole yes. assembly and transfer it to the new unit, whereas this one, you simply mount your ball adapter to the bottom Absolutely. of the do kingpin. Absolutely. Do it in literally minutes. Yep. I've seen a lot about this product. I've actually researched it in the past, and I haven't found any reason that it's not a good hitch. It's a very, very well-designed product, and I know a lot of people that have actually reviewed it really love it. Well, thank so, you. Okay, Paul, so what are we looking at here? This is a Pull Rights part number 4437 uh, OE gooseneck ball. 
our Owen gooseneck ball comes with this nice chain plate. The gooseneck ball itself will go into any factory puck system, Ford, Dodge, Chevy, and Nissan. So for those trucks that come with what we call an OE factory prep puck system or fifth wheel prep package, this is going to fit in that center uh, puck. Ours is a cam system where all we have to do is twist the ball and the ball bearings lock this into okay. the puck. You throw a pin in here to hold yeah, it in place? And you throw a pin. So this is the version with the pin and the chain plate. Okay. And it comes like this as a complete unit. This is all made of high grade US steel and components. We also have the ability to access the bottom of the ball from the bottom side. Uh, we've actually seen where competitors' balls have either froze up or locked up into those pucks. Mm -hmm. Very difficult to get out. All you'd have to do is go in from the bottom side of the truck, take this apart, and you would be able to release the ball. You know, something that you may not be aware of, but as you know, I use the goose box. And the challenge with the goose box at times is where it attaches, especially in the first generation, makes your overhang too close to the bed rails. So in my case, I had to go to a raised ball in the bed so I could get the clearance I needed. And I see here, it's going to naturally give you about an inch and a half Yeah, it's raised. a little bit raised. Um, from all the feedback we've gotten from consumers so far, it's it seems to be about a perfect height for just about any towing situation. Yeah, and this would work in really good. I know you have a beautiful hitch here, but if people have already purchased a goose box and they can't make any more adjustments to it, getting this specific ball with that raise there could come in really handy because it'll give them that extra bed height clearance that they might need. Absolutely, and if there's any consumer out there that have purchased a competitive ball and had it the plunger or the activator damaged, please take a look at this uh, pull right part number 4437. All right, now you want to show me one other hitch that you have here. Yeah. So, Paul, what are we looking at here? This is the uh, pull right super glide um, 16k. This is our OE uh, puck version, and the way it works is we now have super glides that will drop into a factory puck system. So what we've done is we've taken our pull right ISR hitch that goes into the industry standard uh, fifth wheel style rails. Instead of having to put it in these rails, you'll have this bolt on what we call the OE foot or feet kit. This bolts to the ISR style super glide. We have a mounting post that drops through this and attaches it directly to the factory puck system. Great. What I like to point out on our OE systems and feet, and this is true of all of pull right's OE line, is that we're completely flush and flat. When we go to install our hitch, you're dealing with a flat hitch base. The post is completely removable. Most of our competitors, the post is attached, so when you lift up the hitch, this is loose and is going to be in the way and kind of make the hitch hard to line up with the pucks. Yep. Ours comes out, you can clearly see everything and slide the hitch into place. Uh, we have these available for Ford, Dodge, and Ram trucks. Uh, 16 and 18K for the Ford and GM products and a 24K for the Dodge. They're all packaged up. They're on our website at PullRight.com. Can you show me specifically what makes your slider hitch better or competitive to others? I've actually seen this in use before and it's actually pretty impressive how your system works. Yeah, our hitch is a completely automatic sliding hitch and it's designed for these big fifth wheels like this when you go to make that turn that you don't get the trailer into the cab of your truck. Unlike a, a lot of our competitive products that manually work where you have to, to use your judgment on when to use it, get in and out of the truck, pull a series of levers, this product, the only instructions are hook on and drive. When we turn, it automatically turns and slides the fifth wheel away from the truck. This particular model has 14 inches of travel. We build these hitches that go up to 23 inches of travel works effortlessly, you don't even know that the hitch is working and it's going to give you the full, full peace of mind to tow your fifth wheel with a short bed truck. Not to mention we're a fully automatic jaw. If you notice this jaw right here, laser cut steel wraps the trailer kingpin perfectly. To open our hitch, it's really simple. You just lift up on the handle and open. We have no tabs or locking pins that requires you to get into the bed of the pickup. Mm -hmm. To close the hitch, the fifth wheel comes in. It touches this little tab right here, and I'll close it, and it automatically locks. You don't have to climb up into the bed of the truck for anything. So not only are we fully automatic sliding, we're the only fully automatic locking hitch head, and we now have the OE feet system so that you can drop these into your trucks with pucks. Very cool, Paul. Well, you definitely have a great assortment of fifth wheel products here. 
definitely uh, might have to do another video with you trying this stuff out. Appreciate it. All right, thanks, Paul. Thank you.